Hi, I'm Tom from Assured Agronomy. We're a group of five independent agronomists covering Lincolnshire and the surrounding counties. This autumn we've seen high flea beetle pressure and variable oil seed rate establishment. So here are a few key points to consider. Here we are in a field of oilseed rape the first week in October. And as you can see, generally the plants are there. They're just on the small side. The reasons for this is the high flea beetle pressure and drought we've had over the last couple of months. We're looking at fields now which have had two or three insecticide sprays on them and they're still still struggling. Going forward we're going to need to look at different ways we can potentially get our rape established faster, grow away from, from flea beetle pressure to get a better canopy going into the autumn. So here we are in another field of oilseed rape, drilled on the 17th of August. It was drilled with a Sumo DTS drill, which is a Coulter system drill, which has allowed for good seed to soil contact. The seed has all been drilled at a consistent depth and covered again. When you compare that to other systems, such as subsoiling rape, which has maybe left the seed on the surface, not allowed for that good seed contact. 160 kilos of DAP was applied at drilling, which is the equivalent of about 30 kilos of nitrogen and 75 kilos of phosphate. The fertilizer was applied next to the seed, directly in the root zone, which has allowed the oilseed rape to make use of these nutrients straight away. Versus other methods of applying fertilizer, which are applied onto the surface, where either rain is needed to wash the fertilizer in, or the rape has got to emerge first to make use of the fertiliser. Another point to mention in this field is the straw height. The stubble was left around 15 to 20 centimetres, which we believe is hindering the flea beetle and stopping them moving around quite as freely. All of these points we've just mentioned have led to the successful establishment of the oilseed rape. This has meant we haven't had to apply any insecticides to this field. To this field which has had a huge benefit to the environment and to beneficial insects, which will hopefully in the long term help to control flea beetle and other pests such as slugs.